Evans. I'm the designer, glass designer, product designer here at Grab Labs. And today we are talking about the origin of the SIP series, starting with the slush cup. This was a uh, piece that was discontinued a while back, but we grossly underestimated the enthusiasm behind this particular piece. And now we understand why, because it hits really well and it hits well for a lot of different uh, smoking styles. Any depth of water and you can hit it as hard as you want and it functions really well. So by popular demand, this sucker's coming back and it forced us to rethink some other designs and maybe expand this cup into a series, which is how we came up with the SIP series. So we started out um, by thinking cocktails. What a better way to start than the cocktail shaker. Uh, the ability to have kind of that same large volume as the, the sippy cup and um, hopefully a really you know strong uh, function allowing a lot of water or a little water anything anywhere you go and keep very simple sleek styling and then uh, to pair with the cocktail shaker the martini shaker i really had fun playing around with this martini glass design the perk on on this guy is just a little different where it's a, it's kind of around this wide disc uh, like a martini glass, like the foot on a martini glass. And there are eight holes positioned all around the edge of this perk. Um, and the way they bounce off of this exterior angled wall and then back up um, gives you that kind of a little bit more of a restricted hit, um, but it still flows really well. After this guy, we started to think a little more creatively. I've always loved these really simple coffee cups that uh, my family used to have and it wasn't anything special it was just that thick pyrex coffee mug that was just a straight walled mug and so i started to try to think of that there was a way to adapt that to a pipe that would be interesting such a simple form that i think i was i felt like the need to try to spice it up somehow and i got this idea instead of a solid handle to make the handle hollow and to reroute the smoke up and through that handle this one as well, the perk, there's five holes, uh, four around the outside and one at the bottom, uh, which really ends up kind of shooting the bubbles across the bottom and up and around. This one hits really well. I didn't expect it to be bad, but I didn't exactly think it was going to kind of purr the way it did. It's really nice to get the surprises back. You know it's going to work well, but you didn't know it's going to work with that kind of velvety feel to it. And lastly, this was a suggestion internally, kind of that throwback to those little milk jugs you used to get back in the day. It's kind of that nostalgic feel, but um, it was also a challenge to develop, to figure out if we could actually make a little pipe out of a little milk carton. For this, the milk carton, it was figuring out how to get this bowl to attach. We tried it up off the side, out here, and then every time we put it somewhere, it ended up not looking like a milk carton anymore. By adding this detail off of the back, um, both gave us a, a place where it kind of flowed with the design and a place that really it would put, put the bowl the correct distance from your, your mouth and your nose that you needed. And that's this, this little addition actually made this piece work. It works so well. It's so freaking cute. Yeah, there's something really nice about holding this in your hand. It just makes me smile. Uh, hope, it, hope it works for everybody else that same way. The one thing I really learned about this was to really be receptive to um, ideas and input outside of the little design bubble. Um, this was a piece that evolved with a group of people in Grab, um, kind of through every department of Grab, adding a, a little bit of knowledge or suggestion here and there. And um, I really tried to take the time to take that all into account and not um, look past those suggestions, but incorporate them. And I think that it uh, resulted in a really um, while still you know, the con continuity was there, but a, good, a diverse group of products 